We had a great time at homecoming. Bill and Friends is brought to you in part by the makers of the following products. Ivy League Marketing, PBL Investment Group, our great new friends at Positivity Water. Go buy Positivity Water today. And our new friends at Green Top Gifts. Go to greentopgifts.com to receive 15% off. Just use promo code Bill and Friends. See you guys next year at homecoming. Holla! WHCR 90.3 FM, the voice of Harlem. We're live on the campus of Clark, Atlanta. What was your favorite memory here at Clark, Atlanta? Let me tell y'all something. I wouldn't have passed Spanish if it wasn't for John Quill. You have made a tremendous difference. My voice is almost gone. WHCR 90.3 FM, the voice of Harlem. We're live on the campus of Clark Atlanta University. And I'm sitting Woo! with my best friend, Ivy. Happy Scott. homecoming. Happy homecoming, friend. Yes, so excited to be here. Oh I'm happy God. that you're here. I'm happy that you're here. Listen, if it wasn't for Ivy, Positivity Water would not be here. We wouldn't have, we wouldn't have PBL investment groups. We've got Green Top Gifts. Yes, now, yeah. let's talk about you and the importance of your companies and bringing black businesses to America. Yeah, man, this is, first of all, this is so cool. We are here celebrating all this black excellence, and that's why it was so important uh, for the Black Ivy League to be here. Not only is this my alma mater, this is a place that raised me. What I wanted to make sure that I brought the brands that I support here to my people, such as Positivity Water, which is a black-owned alkaline water. It's a great water. We want to rejuvenate. We want to make sure that we're refreshed. But furthermore, as we talk about the Black Ivy League, yeah. Ivy League marketing is all about providing small minority owned businesses with fractional chief marketing officer services so that they can have scale and sustainability so that we can continue to do what we do as black people and just be great. Absolutely. Listen, what is the importance of black owned businesses in our community? Uh, black owned business is wealth, right? It's wealth. When you think about right now with our climate that's going on with you have organizations getting rid of affirmative action. Right now they're trying to get rid of a lot of diversity, equity, inclusion programs. So it's so important that as black people, one, we take advantage of the programs that are available to us, but then furthermore, we're out here building back. We're giving back to our communities yes. and making sure that we know what our worth. So get worth. out there, if you have an idea, know that you can do it because traditionally we haven't had all these businesses in our community. Absolutely. Right now we are the surge, surge of black businesses. There was a bolster during the pandemic and right now what we want to do is make sure that we help them sustain and that they scale. It is about sustaining and scaling and you talked about that. I, I went to one of your seminars recently. You talked about sustaining and scaling. I can't even talk because it's homecoming <laughs> right now. It's homecoming. Sustaining and scaling the businesses. It is very important for black women to have their own business. What is the importance of black women say, hey, I need to invest in myself so that I can uplift other black women? Well, one is generational wealth, right? The thing is, corporate can have a crutch on you, and I was one of those people, and there's nothing wrong with working in corporate. You gotta have the duality of it all, but at the end of the day, if you have an idea that's great, don't wait for someone else to do it. You just do it. There are resources that are available to you. So that's what we have with the Black Ivy League, the Urban League. I partner with organizations such as the Russell Center, as well as um, our Village United. Right now, black women do not get the funding that other people get. And so we want to make sure that black people know that, you know what, we believe in you, we believe in your ideas, and we need to shift the leadership. We need to shift what we're seeing in terms of our communities and our leaders. Listen, that's excellent. We at homecoming. What is your favorite memory of homecoming? Listen, this is my best friend, oh y'all know that. So many. We go way back, 20 years we started here. We started at the same mall together. We did, back in Dallas. Back in Dallas. What's been yeah. your favorite memory here? <laughs> it's, first of all, that is, you putting me on the spot. I am. You you should remember because you okay, know what I'm going to ask One you. of my favorite memories, honestly, was when I pledged AKA. Okay, when Alpha I, Kappa Alpha. When I pledged Alpha Kappa Alpha, sweet Alpha Pi chapter. Um, I say that because right now, as I look at these sea of people, I see the support of my line sisters that are here, yeah. my profiles that are here. It's that lineage that I have back to this institution. Alpha Pi means so much to me, and um, I wouldn't be as much as the woman I am today uh, without Alpha Pi. Absolutely. Thank you so much, friend. We love you. Yeah. We support you. You made this happen for us, and we appreciate you. Okay? Yeah, no problem. So make sure that y'all check out Ivy League Marketing. Um, make sure that you get Positivity Water. Uh, thank you to all yes, of the sponsors you, Posit- that are yes. here. And happy homecoming. Happy thank homecoming. you, Phil. I'm thank so you. proud of you. Thank you. And uh, congratulations on getting inducted into the 40 Under 40. Absolutely. We appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah. Love you. Happy homecoming, happy friend. Happy homecoming. And we'll be right back. Thank you. This has been an amazing experience. Recording live from Clark Atlanta University, my alma mater, my second home. 
to all those people watching, thank you. Thank you for supporting Phil and Friends. Thank you to the sponsors, Positivity Water, PBL Investments, and now Green Top Gifts, and the Black Ivy League. Where would we be without the Black Ivy League? Thank you so much. You're watching Phil and Friends right here on WHCR 90.3 FM, the voice of Harlem. I'll see you later. Peace.